Hey guys, Matt721 here. This is going to be another video on Power and Revolution Geopolitical Simulator 4. So in this video, uh, it's, this is going to be quite different from uh, some of the other ones that I've done previously, because before now, uh, I've the ones I've done, I've done uh, about, the Pyong, about a revolution in Pyongyang, which obviously is fictional, that hasn't happened. Uh, and the Syrian civil war, and I did a video mo more recently on the Ukrainian war. However, this video isn't a war. This, this, there's going to be no fighting of any type in this video, because this is the next scenario on the list, which is the 2016 elections. So in the elections, I'm going to be running as, as the Democrats. I'm going to be... Uh, as Miss Hilda Tilton, and I'm going to be replacing Jack Ahama. Now, both of those do not, definitely do not resemble real life politicians at all. I don't know what you're talking about. We shouldn't. Let's just not go there. But uh, and our our opponent, I think, in the election is going to be Mr. Ronald Trump, who once again, does not represent anyone in the real in the real world. So uh, the, prim the primaries, uh, I think, have begun, and very soon uh, the elections will start. But for now, I'm just going to advance time until they begin. So the elections have begun. Uh, and now it's going to be time for me to start off with my first with my first uh, promise for the campaign. So the tactic with these, I think uh, I'm not 100% sure, but I think the delegates, uh, the amount of votes you get for each uh, for each state. So I think California is the most important one. So we'll start off with that one, and I'm. The problem is, you shouldn't uh, kind of keep your uh, best. You should kind of keep your best promises to yourself, or your best what you think is going to be your best promise to yourself uh, once you begin. So for me, uh, my best promise is going to be the f is going to be to get it is take away all influence of the state on the media and have complete freedom of expression, which should gain me a lot of popularity. But unfortunately. Uh, we can't do that one for now, so I need to find another popular one uh, for for California because California is an important state to win over. Um, so let's have a look. I think I'll go with healthcare, and I will. I will slightly increase the embarrassment for visits to the dock. Do we have enough for that? Yeah, we should do. Let's go for that. And that has shot up my popularity. The legislative elections, uh, that's the same thing as, uh, as we don't really need to worry. Uh, 71% of vote intention in my favour, that's that's great. Uh, have they not uh, started? Oh no, they haven't started their election, so I'm just going to wait for them. Uh, wait for them to get to the same level as me. Uh, one, I think I might actually create another... Uh, there I got it. Il Il not I don't know, I can't pronounce that. Il Il not Illinois, I think it is, but uh, there is... Anyone living in Illinois, can you please tell me how to pronounce the name of your state? I sincerely apologise. <laughs> uh, so I think I should uh, probably increase education budget as well. So, freedom of teachers. Uh, so that could be actually in increasing that could be my uh, that could be my final thing. So I'm going to increase the teacher training. The debate thing. Sorry, it wasn't really clear. Uh, so I'm going to increase the teacher training by two, and that should uh, that should increase the popularity. So we can see there, 
that Ronald Trump has made uh, another rally, but it doesn't matter. I'm just going to advance time now until everyone has made the same amount of campaigns or statements as I have. Okay, so Ronald Trump has made his two promises and they're nowhere near as popular as ours. However, the Democrats really hate this program. Probably because it's not in their best interests. So now I'm going to go to North Carolina and I've got to drastically, drastically change this. Well, I, I assume religions will be, uh, I don't really want to change that because then the re majority religion will heavily dislike me if I do that. I might have a look at research. If I try to do the environment, maybe that would I do the air pollution by four. Oh, that, that that that's really not much. I think I'll go with that. Didn't increase by anything, so I think I'm gonna do one more promise, and we'll do that in. I'll do this in Ohio, and we'll go Wednesday, and let's have a look. Yeah, I sh yeah, they can marry. That's good. I'm gonna try and see if it's a bit of a gamble, but I think it could do something. Oh, that took a bit of a hit to my popularity. I'm not 100% sure why, but again, we'll just uh, let that go and carry on. Hopefully. So Ronald Trump has caught back up to us once again, and oh, he's made one more promise that I haven't actually uh, seen. But when I looked, uh, he was only he he was twice the size of us, which isn't good. So I need to uh, quickly make two more promises. I'm doing these in two, so it's easier uh, to do rather than doing them ones. But. Uh, and also I want to be ahead of him for a little bit, so this is my reason for reasoning for doing it in twos. If I go to work, because I've not really done any of the economy type uh, things. If I already got a minimum wage, that's no. I'm going to go for... If I go for increasing help for employing seniors by 4 billion. We've got enough we don't really have enough budget for that but it's not my issue to be dealing with. Uh, is that going to help? I did slightly improve us but not not amazing. I think we might do three in this uh, little snippet actually. We'll go to oh Texas! I kind of neglected Texas. I'm just going to Sunday and what shall I do? I've not had a look at justice yet, have I? Well, that could be quite controversial, so I think personally I would do that, but I don't think that's... I could again get rid of guns, but going into Texas and doing that might not be the best thing, I think. We'll have a look at in immigration. <laughs> Construction of wall at Mexican border. I think that's the wrong party. <laughs> Let's have a look at that, actually. Uh, constru construction that's received yes votes. One. I'm. I'm just not going to. I'm not going to get uh, funny about that. Say visas. 
and I'm not gonna. I think. No, I don't think any of these immigration uh, things would be good to propose in Texas. I think if I increase police manpower, I reckon they'll like that. I'm sorry if I'm being quite sturdy, but no, we can't afford seven thousand, seven hundred thousand. We'll go for six hundred thousand. Yep, that boosted us up a bit, and I reckon we've got. I reckon we've got uh, one more promise allowed for. And let's have a look at what that promise could be. Go to Kentucky, the KFC. I could do sports, but I feel like that's not going to give me anything uh, great. Unions. Right to strike. Authorised. Let's go ahead with that. Yep, showed us up with popularity just like I had thought. And now, let's continue onwards. And so, with only 29 days until the elections, let's just have a look at how it's shaping up. So, everyone is equal. We're considerably considerably ahead of the independence rally and off camera I've been trying to get a bit uh, closer to him to try to persuade him to drop out but I don't think it's going to happen. Ronald Trump, who is definitely not related to Donald Trump, is uh, increasing his popularity, his program is a lot more popular than it was and he is now at nearly 37% of votes whereas we are at 48, whereas we were at 71 earlier in the campaign, so we need to get this sorted out. Uh, they still don't like the Democrats still don't like my campaign, but it's not uh, as bad as before. Now let's have a look. I could go with energy. Could I build some renewable energy? I might build some more hydroelectricity. I'll build a hundred of them if I can. Oh no, I can build uh, a thousand across the territory. That's is that good or bad? No, I think that's indifferent. Uh, so we're going for eleven. I think this is all I'm going to do this video. I think the the next video will be when I uh, when I finish off this. I'm going to go for South Carolina, because I've been to North Carolina. Um, it's just how many more weeks do we have until the elections? Oh, the debate is the, literally the day before, and they take place on the 8th. So we've got fairly limited uh, amount of time. So I'm going to go for... What should I go for? Go for that. Let's go look in the army. No, I don't want to do national service because they will hate me. Uh, can I build a base? I can promise that. I can promise to build a base. Uh, I don't really want to increase spending. Um, the army guy doesn't like me already, so it might not be the best idea. But. I'm going to go for... Can I change? Uh, no, I don't want to change that. Let's have a look in Parliament. I, c I can maybe increase the powers of Parliament. Let's see how that goes. That did nothing, again. That's a shame. I think I'm going to again go for one more and then I might actually uh, because I think I'm not doing any good uh, promises I might just let it run until the debate so I'll go for this on the Friday right before the debate and then hopefully in the next video I will complete the debate and we'll just I'll let it play for the entire of the video. Uh, 
and I'll take my time with the debate as well. And hopefully you can enjoy it, and we'll do all the we'll do all the build up as well. So yeah, uh, let's just make this one last promise. Transportation. I will increase the bike paths. So that seems good to me. Yep, all sl gone up slightly because of the environment. Protecting that. So yeah, that that should do me for today. Uh, if you enjoyed, uh, like, subscribe, comment, do whatever. I think today's been nice. It's been a nice uh, change of pace from all the fighting of the Ukraine war and the Syrian civil war. Uh, if you prefer this type of video or or the war type videos, let me know. Other than that, uh, I hope you enjoyed. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you all next time.